Hey guys, Darren here. Friday the 13th again. Tonight, let's play Friday the 13th on the NES. Knife to the Mask, Friday the 13th. Nineteen eighty-eight. Let's see. I was like two years old. No, I was like negative five years old in nineteen eighty-eight. Something like that. We all know the torch is a lie. You have to use the lighter. I think you have to kill the zombies to get the lighter. There we go, got the lighter now. Now you just jump around, I think, to get other random stuff like that. Potion. Now I just need a weapon like that. There we go. Now I have the knife. Knife is good. Now I don't have to duck. I know we can run in these small buildings and change people. Let's change over to... So what I want to try to do is have a couple of people who have some weapons. To be able to fight Jason. And there's the Jason alarm. Let's see where he's at. Oh, he's right on top of me. So here's what we're going to do. Go in here. Thank you. And then he's at Paul. So we'll change to Paul. Press down. Immediately go out. And then he's attacking us. Oh, maybe not. And here's where I die. Supposedly you could just run to the right and keep attacking Jason, so let's do that. Let's run to the right. If the screen stops, then we know we found him. Let's run in here, see if he's in here. Oh, why is it getting dark? That's not good. I don't think it's supposed to do that. Okay, now he's at the lake. Who is near the lake? I think it's going to be Laura. I gotta go to the left. She's really fast. Not like that. And now I have to go to the right. And there goes Jason taking a cheap shot. Because there's no way to block against that, by the way. So thank you from the kids. You take a quick turn. 
around the corner. He's in here somewhere. Oh, he's got a machete. Get him. Have the rock for lunch, Jason. And I'm dead. One counselor down, five to go. He's probably going to pop right back up on the kids at the lake. And there he is. Oh, I need that potion, but oh well. Ah, there he is. Dodge him. Nope. Ah. She had a knife too. Something tells me this is going to be a quick game. Pops right back up in the lake. Man, that's the worst spot too. Okay, I think I'm going the right way. Yeah. Okay. And now I'll go to the left. That's a crow taking a cheap shot. Can't dodge the crow. Can't jump on this stage either. Yeah, you're welcome. Thanks for luring me to die. Jason, we meet again. Don't you want to go somewhere else? Yeah, there you go. Finally. Oh, I don't think that was a win, but whatever. This game wants to, to stroke your ego. As an illusion that you can somehow... Oh, I just killed a crow! Back to zombies. station Debbie right here Mark let's find a key oh man it's nighttime that's not good so supposedly you're supposed to go in these cabins with the lighter find the fireplace light all the Fireplaces. I don't know. I don't really know what the significance is if Jason doesn't come to the house. Oh, and also there's these. There are these meaningless messages. Going to the cabin by the lake. Uh, yeah. Thanks. Uh, I just had two or three of my people die there recently. Thanks for bringing that up. Random message left by no one. It's like who's writing the messages? Who's leaving the messages? Could they have something useful written on them? Maybe there would be a redux of this game and they could write something useful on the message, like where to actually find the torch. Let's, oh man, Paul's almost dead. Let's go to George. Because I want everybody to have a knife, at least. Oh, George is slow. Hey, there's two lighters. George throws his uh, rock really far and fast. Does that count for anything? No. Not really, George. Sorry. George, you're good for something. Go in here and light this. Take this random lighter floating from the air and light that fireplace on fire with an empty... How come when I turn back to it, it's not lit again and I light it again? I think maybe you just light enough of them until the messages change and then you know you can um, find the torch or whatever 
And I think I've missed... Uh-oh. Here comes Jason. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Eat a rock! Oh, now I've got him. What? Crows on land now? Who's heard of that? Oh, key. Not that this character is going to be able to use it. I just noticed I'm down two children. I hear the alarm so much I just drown it out at some point. Ooh, knife. Maybe I'll catch Jason in here. Nope. Oh. Go into one of the cabins. Oh! By the lake. Let's check in with Debbie. Debbie do not have a knife yet. Let's go, Debbie. Hey, lighter. Now you can light stuff. Oh, knife. Now you can cut stuff. Cutting in a lighting. Please don't be at the lake. Oh. I think Jason, he just needed a vacation. That's why he was so grumpy. Just kept having his vacation ruined. Kept trying to go to the lake. I guess we'll just take Paul. Sorry, Paul. I don't even think Paul's gonna make it. Paul throws his stuff pretty fast too, but it's not gonna matter. Yeah, yeah. Where is Ashton? There he is. Oh, I dodged it one time, and then he killed me. This game is extremely difficult. George. Uh, let's take a hard right. I don't think we have enough time. Down to two kids. You'd think that would be more manageable. Here we go. That is so hard. It's like Mike Tyson's punch out on steroids. Oh. 
Last counselor. Mark. There's no way. I'm coming, invisible kids, because there's like none left. Here we go. My last guy. Oh man, it's over. Oh, it's brutal. Oh, I had a little bit of life left and it was over. You and your friends are dead. Game over. Oh. Brutal.